Hello, my name is Bearded Dragon, and welcome to the boss fight, well, the second boss fight from Mortal Kombat 2011, and the boss fight for the Mortal Kombat 2 component. So here we see Kung Lao has just won his fight against Kintaro. And now Shao Kahn has killed him. So this was Kung Lao's chapter. But this last fight will involve Liu Kang. <laughs> Witness boy, do you know who I am? The murderer of my friend. I am Shao Kahn, conqueror of worlds. You will taste no victory. You will taste your own blood. Round one, fight! To die. All right, one thing I found with Shao Kahn is when fighting him you need to try and keep him as far away from you as possible. Because if you can keep him at the full screen distance he can't shoulder charge you. Oop, I'm getting a bit closer than I want to. Yep, that's the shoulder charge I was talking about. So, try to keep a full screen distance and the, <sighs> try and dodge his spear. And then, yeah, just keep attacking him with range attacks, trying to keep him at that distance. Occasionally he'll do that. And he also has a axe attack, well, a hammer attack, which is really painful. This is what happens when you get too close. He gets very destructive. He shoulder charges and hammer attacks. So seriously, you need to try and keep him at the full screen distance. With the spear, the best thing to do is to duck it. And then if he throws his hammer, which he hasn't done yet, the best way to defend against that one is to... There we go, uppercut actually worked. The best way to dodge his hammer is to jump over it. Because if it hits you, it will stun you instantly. And he can have a habit of chaining hammer throws. So yeah, just try and maintain this distance and then just keep spamming range attacks. Cause see your x-ray does very little damage compared to his. So yeah, just keep him at a distance. Because yeah, personally I don't enjoy trying to fight him close on. I also don't like to try and win with just timing out with more health. I do want to try and beat him. And as you can see when he gets this big distance, he seems to pose a bit more often than what he does when he's up close. And this... Sh oh, I thought that would have been it. That's why I got cocky. <laughs> there we go. And that's how you beat Shao Kahn. The easiest way. And this is the end of the Mortal Kombat 2 component of Mortal Kombat 2011 and the second boss fight of the whole game which Liu Kang does both of the first lot of boss fights and as we see here Liu Kang has just killed Shao Kahn Again. And the gods the have, spoken. Gods have spoken. Earth Realm is free of Shao Kahn forever. The price of victory was almost too steep to pay. Kung Lao's death is my fault. I encouraged him. 
Our triumph was not meant to be achieved in this way. I see now. He must win refers to you. But to prevent Armageddon, you needed to defeat Shao Kahn, not Chang Sung. It cannot be. Shao Kahn is dead. Yet the future remains unchanged. Shao Kahn is finished. Melina is his heir. She should rule. Melina? She exists only because of my sorcery. And you breathe because I restrain mine. Emperor! You live! And Shao Kahn did not die. Quan Chi accelerated my recovery. Emperor! I not one word. Because of you! Outworld can no longer merge with Earthrealm. There may yet be an alternative, Emperor. Invasion. Uh, invasion? Do you mock me? Sindel's ward prevents me from setting foot in Earthrealm. Have you considered why your wife and Empress chose to betray you in this particular fashion? Of course. But even after millennia, her motives are a mystery. She realized that the safeguards afforded by the Elder Gods through mortal combat are but fiction. She sacrificed herself to give protection the Elder Gods could not, so Earthrealm could not suffer as had Edania. Indeed. And thank you for watching my Mortal Kombat boss fight, and please tune in for others. Bye!